especially as we come out of lockdown. Um, I think the positive thing about uh, COVID-19 is the acceleration towards digitization because um, organizations and, um, you know, governments were all forced to um, turn to technology um, to, to meet and to transact and to do business. Um, we are hopeful that uh, this trend will continue across the continent, particularly when it comes to trade. I mean, one of the um, initiatives that we are actively pushing is digitizing trade, you know, making um, trade a digital, a digital activity so that you don't rely on paper. Um, you know, to move documents around. That was one of the challenges that was faced um, during the lockdown because people had to come into offices to check documents, etc. We believe that as we continue to drive trade across the continent, that um, digitizing trade will certainly help to, to accelerate it, make it easier, bring down the costs of, of doing business. We think also um, sort of mobile money, um, electronic payments, remittances um, will continue to be a key driver um, across sub-Saharan Africa. Um, in terms of power, um, hopefully um, we will continue to see um, a scaling up of um, fintech solutions for power. You know, so that if you look at what MCOPA is doing in East Africa, for instance, where they are using renewable energy um, to provide power to over a million homes and small businesses, um, the hope is that we can continue to scale those types of um, initiatives to electrify um, sub-Saharan Africa. Those large scale power projects um, are increasingly difficult, just given all that is required to get them across the line. And more and more, um, solar energy and other types of renewables um, are increasingly um, easier to provide. Um, so I think in terms of economic development and economic activity, certainly many of the governments are severely constrained because they have been impacted by lower government revenues, as well as having to um, engage in extra fiscal spending. So debt to GDP ratios have gone up. Um, their capacity to borrow is limited, um, but hopefully we will see more PPP projects coming on stream, um, you know, to, to help alleviate the burden of some of the governments um, and increase private sector participation. I think certainly that um, the private sector is going to be a key enabler um, to drive economic growth across sub-Saharan Africa.